All right, guys, Big Nate, we are back in the Lego room. Um, I have separated most of the sets into the different projects. So I want to just go over the first couple of them while I had a few minutes. Uh, so the first pile is going to be the trains. Got this 40 year anniversary one. Um, love to motorize this, but I know it's a very small build. So I don't know, might end up with a cold tender customization behind it so we can push it back and forth or it might just sit on the display we'll see um but my plans are to have that paired up with i've been collecting parts for a train shed i'm gonna base it off the old nine volt train shed the red and black one i've got a lot of these dark red parts and black supports technic beams old uh 12 volt train track parts so i can build a pit really good model that um see two versions of this passenger train there are two copies in this box but i've already pinched the motor and the battery pack out of one of them to motorize the hogwarts express i built last year um this one though we've got this boost set and i think there's two copies of this in here too the idea is to take these um computer what do they call these things on whatever this port is right here and hook up the light sensors to them so that they can read colored markers on the track and then they will stop blow whistle stuff like that that's the theory behind those um over here my son found his tote of old hidden side sets he is starting to get those out and piece them together um i know we have at least three graveyards because i was collecting those for a harry potter graveyard Got the high school, and then we've got Crab Shack, a couple of carnivals, another fire engine, stunt bike, racing cars, and then this bus. This is a second copy of the bus I picked up. I've already motorized this. You can see in there, it's got a shaft, a gear shaft in there, and a battery pack. Um, the idea was I was going to design this to where a magnet steered the front wheels, and it followed a wire under the base plates, but I haven't quite figured it out yet. It was a project I was working on two years ago and I kind of just gave up on it, but we'll come back to it for sure. All right, the Harry Potter sets. Got the Hedwig and the Dovey, couple of Brickheads. The newer uh, Room of Requirement, which is a Christmas gift, so. Uh, Definitely gonna build this one, add it into the castle display somewhere. Last one we got to build is the horn tail. And uh, I've already got the Phoenix. So the horn tail, Doby, and the smaller Hedwig will go well with the, the Phoenix I got up here. And uh, eventually I'll have one of these shelves cleared off and put the nice white backdrop Kia shelving in there. Make it a good display for doing streams. Um, let me see, so project number four, it's going to be Marvel sets. Got a couple of mechs, a couple of sets I picked up on clearance. I had to get this Ghost Rider when I seen him. Ghost Rider and Carnage are two of my favorite characters when I collected comics. There's a four and up Batmobile, but I like the characters. At least they had full length legs on them. Uh, let me see, another one I found on sale, Thor. I like Thor and I wanted Jane Thor there too. Mighty Thor as they called her. Uh, let's see, got these two on clearance. Half price X-Wing Jet, I mean, why not? And also got this one on clearance. Spider-Man Final Battle. Um, I like this one and I think I'm gonna try and get the Sandman that goes on the top. That's my plan for that. And then I don't know where this is gonna go. It might just be a shelf display or I might try to work it into the city somewhere. All right, project number five is gonna be the Enchanted Forest, kind of dark forest area. So picked up this dream set, another clearance item from Walmart. Uh, got the gift with purchase. Just those magical workshop. Um, picked up two of these. The Ninjago just kind of threw in here because it's got a little fantasy to it. There's actually 
three copies of this set in here. And I sold the figures off already on the other two. So that'll give me quite a lot of pieces to build the side of a, one of the mountains. And another Jago set. All right, so let me see. The second copy, three in one medieval castle. Um, I have a plan to modify this slightly and build like a large wall with a watchtower on top. So we'll see. I got to look around and re rickable, get some ideas, or just draw it out myself. Uh, let me see. Part of the outside of the forest is going to be a campground. In that campground, we're going to have the Toy Story. So, I've got most of the Toy Story characters, and I've got a couple of extra soldiers I've been picking up here and there. So, that is the idea with those. All right, next we got up Ninjago Dragon. Uh, I have a big Ninjago ice mech also I plan on making a scene with each two of fighting each other uh, let me see next building for our little fantasy forest got this on clearance on amazon from ashes cottage from the wish movie uh, and then the last one ideas creator treehouse that will ring that out all right the city stuff all this i'm gonna do a separate video on i didn't realize how much we had uh, let me see, you got a mega construct train. Hogwarts icons, that's not going to be in any of the projects. That's going to be another build where if I get the Kia shelving put up, I'll build that and then put it up in the corner. Make it look nice. Um, let me see, somewhere I've got Benny's spaceship. Somewhere in here. And we're going to put the couch set here. The movie Benny's friends and I think I'm gonna build this galaxy explorer match it up with Benny's spaceship as a little scene and then put the giant Duplo unikitty together all on one table I think that'll be real nice uh, a couple of sets here that didn't really fit in everything just more of the same like these they're just gonna be built and displayed Thanos glove Batman cow got the Blacktron cruiser gift for purchase Oh yeah, my little Jeffrey. I got this cool little pirate set. I don't think it's even open yet. Well, that's it for now, guys. Those are the first, what, six, seven projects I'll be working on. Oh, some friend stuff too. Can't forget that, but we'll do friend separate too because we got a ton of that. All right, so thanks for watching part two. Bye-bye.